My name is Cosmo, I'm here with Grilla, and we are going to use the chimp today to smoke and barbecue some fish collars. Fish collars are kind of up near the front, near the head of the fish. A lot of people throw them out. They're so delicious, full of fat, full of flavor. A lot of Japanese restaurants tend to use them and sell them there, but a lot of fish markets uh, kind of just throw them to the wayside. So we went to our local fish market today, asked them if they had any collars, and they were um, nice enough to give us these black sea bass collars. So we're gonna use those today. Uh, not much to do to them, I just cut them in half. I like to use a nice kind of thick backed knife for that. Split one. There we go, split two. And we're gonna use our Grilla All Purpose Rub, a great barbecue rub. It's good on meat, it's good on fish, it's good on vegetables, it doesn't really matter what you're doing. We love it, again, why we call it All Purpose. So, you really wanna coat the collars in this almost like rubbing blackening spice on something before you do it. All right, and flip them. Get it all over nice and coated. All right, and we are gonna set that chimp to 325 degrees. We're gonna cook these for about 45 minutes to an hour. The bigger the collar, the longer the smoke, obviously. And we're just gonna do it simple. This is finger food for me. We're gonna serve it with a little bit of cabbage slaw some grilled jalapeno, poppy seed, slaw dressing, and some lemons. That's all we're gonna do. Uh, you'll be able to find the recipe for the slaw, for the dressing, and of course, for the collars on the site. So check the link below. We've got the chimp set to 320 degrees for these collars. We want a nice smoke, so we actually set it over here to pro mode, so you get that pro smoke. It's gonna just be a little richer smoke flavor. Put them skin side down in there, make sure they've got enough space. Let those go. We'll check them about 45 minutes. All right. Our collars will go in just over an hour. They are perfectly smoky, delicious, and done. We're gonna take them off, go dress our coleslaw inside, and get these finished up. All right, we've got our smoked barbecue fish collars. I like to eat these just like ribs or something like that. We're just gonna do smoked collars and some nice coleslaw. We did a grilled jalapeno poppy seed dressing for the coleslaw. A little bit of salt in there. I have Napa cabbage, red onion, a little bit of fennel, and a little bit of carrot in here. Again, you'll find that recipe down below. A little bit of that poppy seed dressing. This slaw is really great, just mix it to order. No need to make it ahead of time, stick it in the fridge. Mm. And that is good. And that's all there is to it. And this for me, again, you use a fork, use your fingers. See that nice white flaky collar meat, a little bit of coleslaw. That's delicious. Check out the link below, look on the website, look at the recipe. It's all there for you. Please try it, let us know what you think.